Hello, and let's take a minute to look at this Long March booster uh, from China that's going to re-enter, um, well, re-enter the Earth's atmosphere and be destroyed hopefully tonight. But anyway, uh, let's. This is it, just floating. It's debris. It uh, it's uncontrollable. It's uncontrollable. Uh, it is flying around the Earth. Something similar to this. Uh, it crosses the equator up to about 41 degree latitude, and on the other side of the planet, it would be 45 degrees south latitude. So anywhere in here, in this range, it could hit all around the world. Now, if you look here, this is called a periapsis. It's the closest, closest point to Earth in an orbit of anything, anything. Apoapsis is the furthest distance. So what we have to do is lower the periapsis to just where it's touching the Earth's atmosphere and it's, it keeps hitting air, keeps hitting air, it slows down. Each time it does that it brings the periapsis or the apoapsis down. It is in atmosphere. It's starting to hit just a little bit of air. Yeah. Uh, We got a periapsis up here of 30,000 and you can see it dropping because every time the the wind is slowing it down you have to recalculate where it's going to hit but now you can see it'll start getting hot see what happens Getting a little hot over here, but I think it's going to cool off. Yes, things are starting to cool off. So this big booster is going to hit somewhere. Oh, looks like it might hit on land. Calculating on land. Comes out of the atmosphere on fire. Parts and pieces have been rained off. Little chips and parts. And this is going to hit the ground. Definitely going to hit the ground, maybe. Oh, here it comes. We'll slow time down and watch it hit. 300 meters per second. Down, breaking a sound barrier. goes parts and pieces. Anyway, hope you liked the video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.